What we're looking at right here is our European extended MJO forecast. Now we're currently sitting somewhere around phase five and six. I'll tell you this, the state's weather gets a lot more interesting if we push through phase seven to phase one as we're getting into winter or as we're in winter. And look what's being forecast right now. We're expected to get into phase seven as we get into the end of November. And then look what's happening here as we get towards mid-December. The MJO potentially could be entering a phase eight. A phase eight tends to be colder and snowier for the states. And depending on what's happening with our other teleconnections, this could really favor a snowy December and early start to January. If you haven't already seen, this is NOAA or the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration's three to four week temperature outlook. So this would be from November 22nd to December 5th. And it looks cold for much of the US except for portions of the Southern Plains and the Southeast. And take a look at our precipitation forecast. This is also favoring a lot of moisture for much of the country from the West to the East Coast. Could this be because of our MJO phase trying to enter into phase seven and eight as we get into this time frame, combined with this unstable polar vortex and weak La Nina? This is what I mean when I say that December could actually be cold and snowy from coast to coast a lot of times, typically the weather favors the west or favors the east. But with what's going on in our atmosphere, we may see a very, very wintry United States for the month of December. 